Hello audience, and welcome to my first LB. I say my first because I did appear in a previous LP that belonged to somebody else, but that's a completely different story for another time. For right now, this is my first LP. And we're going to be playing Spyro the Dragon. The audio is a bit messed up and the video is on my dazzle. So, bear with me. Let's do a new game. Let's overwrite this one. I can't really ask you guys to uh, join my LP that I was already doing. Even though it wasn't really an LP, it was just me playing the game. I already tried to LP this game today, but I made the mistake of moving my microphone around, so there's a bunch of scraping and scratching in the audio. That sounds like... <laughs> and it's really annoying, and goes on throughout the entire two videos that I made. So... This time we're going to try not moving the microphone and see if that works. We're going to hope it does, because if it doesn't, I have no other idea of what to do. All right, so we start off with nothing more than full health and four lives. Let's go free Nestor. This game was the first game I ever owned as a child. Kill him first. Kill him second. Anyway, first game I ever owned as a child. The second one was the first Crash Bandicoot. And the third one was Tetris Plus. And I loved all three of them. I don't... I actually lost all of them the first time we moved and I think I was five then anyway back then I was terrible at the game I'm still not the best out there but at least I don't suck but hey, what can you do? I was five. Anyway, let's go free our second dragon. He's over here. Sigh is what I just did. Inside this little hollow here, some more gems and an extra life. Got those purple chests hold an extra life. Here's the uh, second level or so-called Dark Hollow. That level scared me when I was five. But, hey, forgive me, I was five. The 
are not yet ready to fire up. First, you must complete one of the other armies of man. Interesting story about Argus. I didn't even know about him until I was six. I played this game for a year and a half before I realized, oh, hey, there's an area over there. Maybe I should go in and see if there's something there. And Argus had quite a different message for me. Because, you know, I'd been playing for a while, and he says you can't go in because you haven't completed an artisan world yet. By then I'd completed all the artisan worlds except for the flight level. And I didn't even know about the flight level. Anyway, we free this dragon. His name is Thomas. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. Anyway, I hear that his name was something different in the demo, and they changed it for some reason, but I can't remember what his name was in the demo, because I never had the demo. It was always Thomas for me, because that's what the game called him. Anyway, clever players might actually be able to only have to go up there once, but I have to go up there twice. I'm not a clever player. I don't claim to be a clever player. I'm just a player. So don't hate. <laughs> uh, that's not at all the message that I try to convey. Anyway, we just completed the home world. So, gearing up, this is where we're going next. Supposed level one. Stone Hill. And that's what's in store for us next episode, but for the rest of this episode, all we can do is say goodbye, and I hope that this video captured everything that I want it to. So I will see you guys later.